News is a breaking weather update. Right now we've got a tornado on the ground at uh, approximately 7th and Jefferson. I'm willing to yes, take, cover take cover right, right now. now. We do have a Both. tornado on the ground. This Graduation and there's a tornado.
Hey, I don't know if you can tell on this camera, and I don't know if you can hear, but these clouds are rapidly spinning. That right there is a tornado. Holy crap. There it is. Oh, I don't know if you saw that. Holy crap. I hope this is taking an awesome video of that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, sweet Jesus, keep me safe. Take it up, I can't film! I'm talking, I, I, I can't film! I got it, I got it. I got it. I got it, I got it. Stop, stop, okay. stop, stop. We need to take it up on the right. Yes. Move your head, Isaac. Move I got it on video. Oh, okay. you man. Okay, stop, stop, stop. Okay, we need to run off if we want to stay with it. Oh my gosh, I just saw a car flying through the air. I just saw a car flying through the air. I got it all on video. I got it. Thought I'd warn you guys if it starts turning this way. Um, I don't know. I think if it starts coming this way, you guys can run into my house, seeing as your guys is on, is on this side. But I think it's going to stay south. I'm worried about my wife. She's working at the hospital. Oh, yeah. I'm sure they're somewhere they can go there. <sighs> yeah, I mean, I work there too. They'll be safe. She's on the bottom floor, but that is nasty. That is insane. I watched that whole thing develop all the way across. Are you ready? Like it, 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 it started way over there. I could see it. And then I went and grabbed a better camera because my phone sucks. Well, right now we don't have reports of a confirmed tornado on the ground, but we do have National Weather Service oh, wow. personnel stating that Galena has a public report of a funnel cloud. Tornado again. sirens once again going off in Joplin. Those are definitely power like flashes that we are seeing. And on the southwest side of Joplin, I notify, notify, large tornado on the ground doing massive damage. I'm going to let you take over for a minute. Yes, Jeremiah, right now it does look like there is a tornado on the ground in the southern portions of Joplin, just to the south of our station here. It is taking out those power lines. You can see those flashes on there. Yeah, Everybody, absolutely. if you live in southern Jasper, northern Newton, take cover yes, please. right now. Please I am telling you to yes, take, cover take cover right, right now. now. We do have a Folks, tornado on the ground. This is a tornado. Yeah, this is a very dangerous situation. We cannot stress this enough. If you were in Joplin. That's for all the There's the power. Yeah. There's the end of it. It's ready to go to one house. If that starts kicking up really bad, we're going to have to move that it. That sort of looks like the end. There goes another train. Well, there's just, they were just popping over there left and right, all the way around. Okay. You see how it's going? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, see it all going out over there? Pretty powerful tornado. You can see that it was kicking out those three yeah, or It continues to push off to the east in Joplin. A very dangerous situation once again. Very dangerous lightning. It's a very large hail in store also. So continue to take cover from this storm. 
We can see that tornado on the ground from our tower cam. We are continuing to track that. KZRG 24 Hour Storm Center. Good afternoon. I'm Josh Marsh, live from the KZRG 24 Hour Storm Center. We are watching a severe thunderstorm warning. This cropping up in southeast Kansas. Primarily, we're going to be watching Crawford and Cherokee County. Those are the big concerns at this hour. It's going to be impacting McCune, Kansas, as well as Weir, and has the potential to hit the Jasper County area. Keith, what, what are we seeing right now so far? We're, we're hearing the uh, sirens. Right now, we've got a tornado on the ground at uh, approximately 7th and Schifferdecker, eastbound. Eastbound at 7th and Schifferdecker. So, once again, uh, what have we heard so far about this tornado? Uh, we don't know anything about size or intensity at this point. We just have some reports. Uh, initially, it was at uh, 7th and Central City Road. We have unconfirmed reports of debris at 7th and Range Line. And where, where do we expect this, Keith? Where, where is this going to be pushing forward? Okay. 
good. We're good. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Mike, we're going to do it. We interrupt regular programming to bring you this weather alert. All right, good evening, everyone. I'm going to continue to update you on this uh, dangerous storm and, of course, the damage that I've gotten so far as it has rolled right through the Joplin Metro. First off, let's look at this cell now. We are still picking up rotation. It's on the east side near Sarcoxy, but we are losing the rotation very, very quickly. I'm not overly concerned. I, I would assume the tornado has lifted or at least is just containing a funnel cloud at this point in time, but uh, that's something that
a look or continue to watch the radar signatures and we're we're find exactly what it is predicting. Let's see if I can even get an update on that. I'm working on my computer at the same time. And uh yeah, the radar signal is on. Uh I saw the dot at the top of the screen. Chapter one central fifty at five ten feet heavy seven five 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 Traffic signals are gone, cars are flipped over, power lines across the road everywhere. Go ahead. Free information, debris all over and uh, overturned vehicles. I was just advised that Kodiak is blocked north of V Highway with uh, telephone poles and a building. You can't get in that way. Okay, which way should I come to try to get to you? I'm trying to find a way back around. 30 seconds impassable eastbound. And I've got a lady packaged up. It's the one that had a, uh, she's got a pretty severe cut on the top of her head. I've got the bleeding stop for now, but. I said a male subject approached me, said that he had multiple injuries, possibly over at Wall and 30th. I'm trying to make my way over there. It's heavy debris. Copy. Uh, you turn around and head back that direction. I've got a child here with a pole impaled in their leg. I'm trying to help them. That's in labor. Where is the nearest place she can go and find a doctor? 716 to station 71. They were going to St. John's. Copy. Thank you. Negative. St. John's was knocked out by the storm. All the patients from St. John's are being transported to Memorial Hall by school buses. Responding. She's got uh, her family in a pickup here. It looks pretty much like uh, DOA. Okay, uh, stand by one second. It's leveled. Oh my god. Oh my god, Kat, there's in house, there's some people. Oh my god. Oh my god, these things are crushed. That's a school. Oh my god. Is that F4? Be a four. Oh my god. There's people walking out. They're, they're waving at us. Oh, god. oh get, get someplace where I, they can get out. I don't hate Hello? My mom? It's no, it's my busy. Mom? It's a fast busy. There's no answer. I'll keep calling. Show me where those people need help. I heard them screaming. Chris? Kathy, where are they stuck? Mom, there's people. Kathy. There's somebody in here. Oh my god. Oh! Hello? 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 Oh, give her, sweetie. Give her, honey. Give her, sweetie. It's okay. Give her, baby. I'm so. Come on, sweetie. Oh, come here, baby. It's okay. It's okay, sweetie. I know. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> Anybody help? Oh my god. First thing I come up on is is uh people that didn't make it. Look at this devastation. Cars tore up. Out there. It's really, um, it chokes you up when you see what's happened here, Paul. I mean, uh, take a look. I mean, it's everything. It's just completely demolished. I mean, homes are, are destroyed. Families' lives have been, been turned upside down at this point. And, uh, people are just looking for their loved ones. They're looking for family members. If you take a look here at this neighborhood, all I can say is it looks very reminiscent of what we saw last month in excuse me in uh, Tuscaloosa. Mike, are you all right?